today's color review is Benjamin Moore Revere Pewter versus Accessible Beige. These two great paint colors have been around a long time. So I'm going to show you what makes them different, what they have in common. I'm also going to show you what they look like side by side in both the north and south facing rooms. And I'm going to give you three valuable tips that you should know before deciding to paint either one of these paint colors in your home. When it comes to picking the right great paint colors, it's a lot more complicated than you may think. How many of you out there have painted your home with a great paint color and you were disappointed on the way it turned out? I want to know, so let me know in the comment section down below. The truth is, almost all great paint colors will react differently depending on the undertones, the lighting, the type of interior decor, and let's not forget all the different types of undertones that you may have in your home. So, having said that, let's take a closer look at the undertones of these two paint colors. Right here is Review of Pewter. Now watch what happens when I compare it with Accessible Beige. They both have a green undertone. And by the way, if you want to know a little bit more about either one of these paint colors, feel free to check out the link right above me. Now, I want to show you something else. Notice how Accessible Beige is warmer than Revere Pewter, and Revere Pewter is cooler than Accessible Beige. This is really important to know for a lot of reasons, especially when it comes to pairing these with the type of interior decor or undertones that you may have in your home. If you don't get this right, this could end up being a costly mistake, and I don't want that to happen to you. Next, I'm going to show you what these two paint colors look like side by side in both a north and south facing rooms. This is a classic example of two interior paint colors that share the same undertone, but they're drastically different in more ways than one. So let's talk about the lighting. This is what Benjamin Moore Revere Pewter and Accessible Beige look like in a south facing room or any room that receives a lot of natural lighting side by side. Notice how Revere Pewter looks cooler than Accessible Beige and Accessible Beige looks warmer than Revere Pewter. By the way, I don't want you to judge either one of these paint colors strictly based on what they look like in a south facing room because there's a lot more that goes into picking the right paint color besides lighting. Now, I want to show you what these two paint colors look like in a north facing room. Notice how Revere Pewter looks a little bit darker than Accessible Beige and Review Pewter has a little bit more of a blue undertone. But when you look at Accessible Beige, it does a really good job of holding its true color. Next, I'm going to give you three valuable tips that you need to know about before deciding to paint either one of these colors in your home. By the way, if you're new to this channel, feel free to subscribe. I give you valuable knowledge like you're seeing right here in this video. All right, let's get back to it. Tip number one, always compare your colors. Here's what I mean. Just because I compare Revere Pewter versus Accessible Beige doesn't mean either one of these colors is warmer or cooler. So here's what I mean. When I get Revere Pewter and I compare it with Classic Gray, look what just happened. Revere Pewter is warmer than Classic Gray. Also, if I were to get Accessible Beige and I were to compare it with Pashmina, Look what just happened. Accessible beige is cooler than Pashmina. So this is why it's so important to compare your colors with the other colors that you may have in your home to find out if it's really going to be cooler or warmer. Tip number two, for those of you out there that are going to paint your room with Revere Pewter and you have a floor tile that looks like this that has a pink undertone, I would be very careful about pairing these two colors together. That's a different topic for another time. Now, for all of you out there that are thinking about painting your room with accessible beige and you have a carpet that looks like this that has some pink undertones, when you compare these two together, they clash. This is why it's so important to compare your colors with both your fixed and furnished items that you may have in your home or else you could be making a costly mistake that you'll later regret, and I don't want that to happen to you. 
Revere Pewter and Accessible Beige have the same undertones, but as you can see, they're so different in so many ways. And this is why picking a gray paint color is so complicated. What do you think of these gray paint colors? Or if you have any experience painting either one of these paint colors in your home, let me know in the comment section down below. If you need help on finding the perfect paint color and you want it professionally done, then feel free to check out the link in the description section down below. I show you how I can help you with any of my online packages, regardless where you live in North America. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.